This is tutorial number 76 and it covers how to make grass scenery in SolidWorks using PhotoWorks. Now to start off, let's open up a brand new part file. Let's click File, click New, click Part, click OK. Now what we're going to do first is we're just going to sketch out an area that we want to turn into grass. So let's click Sketch, click Rectangle, click any plane, and just draw out a square. Now let's extrude it out, click OK, and we have our grassy area that we want to cover. Let's say that the top surface is going to be the grassy area that we want to cover. Now there's two ways that we can put grass on using PhotoWorks. We can either use uh, a material that is in the SolidWorks or PhotoWorks library, or we can use a JPEG or an image that we have, use it as a decal of say a certain type of grass and we can throw that on there and also make grass scenery. So the first one I'm going to show you is how to use material within PhotoWorks. So have first turn on your PhotoWorks just so everyone remembers add-ins, select your PhotoWorks, click OK. Now you can open up your PhotoWorks from here and you can click material And what we're going to do is we're going to select a material to throw on that face. Now, from all the materials that are down here, to get grass, it's under organic, miscellaneous, and then you have grass. Now, we want to put it on this top surface here, so just click, drag, and throw it onto the top surface. And you can see that we have our grass now. And with this, we're able to play with how big and how small the instance of all the grass is. So if we pull it in, it's very tight knit and say this was a home that we're going to put on there. That would be the type of grass we'd want to see. It looked like a field or a home. But say the scenery or wh what we're doing, it's very close to the ground or close to the grass, close to the object. We want to pull this out so we can actually see more of the blades of the grass. So playing with this, we're able to change what the pattern of the grass is going to look like to suit the need of whatever project we're working on. Now once we have it set to what we like, click OK, and we can run PhotoWorks. We can click Render, and now it's going to render what the grass is going to look like using the material that we have selected already and the lighting and all the other conditions. It's going to come out with the image using the PhotoWorks. And now we have our image using the material that we've laid on there, using the lighting that we have everything set to right now in PhotoWorks. This is the image that we're going to get. Now let's try the other way. Instead of using material, let's use a decal. So right now let's go into PhotoWorks here and let's delete the grass that we just put on as the material. And now let's put on a decal. So let's click PhotoWorks, decal. And right now, just throw any of these ones on the top surface. Click Browse. And I've included grass on the DVD. So using this image, let's open it up. And now we have the decal on the surface that we want to play around with. Now, why you would want to use this grass compared to the one that SolidWorks provides is, you know, let's say there's 20 different kinds of grass, different pictures, different images. You can take a picture or you can find a picture on the internet of exactly the type of grass or the type of scenery that you want and you can throw it on here. And again, with the other one, you're able to open it up to make the blades grass appear larger 
and you can make it go smaller again. It's just to suit your need of the scenery. Now, once you've selected how big it is and how much you want, click Accept, and then you can render it again the same way. So just click Render, and we're going to go through the same process as the other one using the lighting, the deco that we put on, it's going to create an image of our scenery. And now we have the image with the decal on it. So by using either the material that's provided by SolidWorks or an image of grass that you found either on the internet or taken by yourself, you can easily put it onto a part customize how big, how small it's going to be, and you can make some scenery around whatever it is, whatever project you're making. And this concludes our tutorial on how to make grass scenery within SolidWorks using PhotoWorks.